So let me get this... Okay, they won last game, and they won the game before that, and they were beside each other. Are the Leafs on a friggin' winning streak?! I'm curious to know what the guarantee is this year. Leafs beat the Sens 3-2 in regulation for their third win of the year in second straight. There was a two-week gap between win one and two, and a two-day gap between two and three. What has happened to the Senators? I don't get it. The Leafs were out shooting them, out chancing them. Realistically, the game should have been a lot worse than 3-2 for the Sens, but... It's the Leafs, and they like to get my heart all pitter-patter. Grabowski was able to play Grabowski's game last night. He got a goal, finally. He got a couple of steals. Way to go. But, and I'm giving you credit, but I also want to see you do that against better opponents. Which I wouldn't expect to be saying about the Senators at this point in the season. Dominic Moore friggin' rocks. That was like the best move John Ferguson Jr. ever made. Which is kind of sad. But it's true. He brought in Tosca the two? No way. And you think he wants to stay in the NHL? Luke Shen, first regular season NHL fight against Chris Neal. Not a bad first opponent. Sticking up for his teammate Matt Stajan again and getting in there real scrappy. He had the visor on, but it uh, didn't look like it helped him much. But the point is he showed up, right? And I haven't decided yet. Again, it's early in the season, but I think I like this year's team better than last year's, even if they do worse, because I'm entertained. They're not going to put up with any crap. And when they're in the game, they're really in it. They've been out of a few of them, but they've been really in most of their games so far, win or lose. And I love that as a fan. I love that. That's all I expect from you. So that's my question to you today. What about this team do you either not like or like compared to last season's team? I gotta say, I like Luke Shen. I like Dominic Moore, even though he wasn't last year's team. He's got a more prominent role. And I like that they just don't quit. My next question, and I've asked this before, this is directed at Sens fans. In case you don't know what that means, it means, what the heck gives? As a Leafs fan, I am supposed to hate the Senators. But it's really hard to hate a team that's doing so bad. It just doesn't make sense to me. Can you explain it, can you? I know we're supposed to hate them, but look at how talented their roster is. Daniel Alfredson is one of the most gifted forwards in the game. They got Spezza, when he's on, he's on. Heatley always seems to be on. Anton Volchenkov is one of the most underrated defensemen in the game. Jason Smith had some grit. They got Mike Fisher, Antoine Vermette. I don't get it. And you can't put it all on goaltending. Personally, I don't think your goaltending's been that bad that you would be, what are they, second last in the NHL now? They're worse than the Leafs, I'll tell you that much. So, Senators fans, leave your comments in the little box. What up? But just a reminder, Leafs, two-game winning streak, it still counts, with a 3-2 to two win over the Ottawa Senators, nine points in eight games. And I know it's unrealistic, but I did a little calculating, and look how many points the Leafs are on pace to get. Yeah! I know, I know, shut up. Just let me enjoy it for a little while, okay? Last thing I gotta mention, so sorry guys, I almost forgot. The New York Islanders, as TSN put it, played their best game of the season last night, and lost. Cam Ward of the Carolina Hurricanes made a ridiculous, inhuman, undescribable 57 saves. 5-7. My first question is, who the hell let the Islanders get 60 shots? My only other comment? Damn. And Leafs fans, take a look at Cam Ward's mask and pads. If you can tell me what looks just a little familiar about them, you get some bonus points for me because I just noticed this. Maybe I missed the boat.